what the law says because it's a personnel set, um, discussion. This edition of the Ridley Report is brought to you by LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them. Oh, I'm here to ambush interview politicians. <laughs> Are you on the council? Yes. Oh, question for you. Sure. So why shouldn't I be able to watch this meeting? Why should it be closed? The non-public session? Yes. I don't know. Something that's not for the public. Well, if I have to pay for it, why shouldn't I be able to watch it? I'm not sure what you're asking me. We have a state law. Go talk to the state legislators and ask them why under 93B okay, that uh, there are restrictions on non-public sessions. They set the law. We do not. I'm following the law as the other counselors. That's the where you need to go to get your answer. Are you required by law to make this non-public? Uh, I think that in some cases there, yes, it is. Depends on the topic, but yeah. It is. All right, thanks. Personnel issue. So we will not be, that's why it's a non public session. And okay. It wouldn't matter what the law says because it's a personnel set, um, discussion. It would not be open to the public ever. Well, why? I mean, I have to pay for these personnel, so why shouldn't I be able to know what you're doing with these personnel? When you go to your job and you have to sit down in front of human resources, do you want the rest of the staff behind you? Well, if I'm on those discussions, no. This is about privacy, an individual's privacy, and that is overweighed by um, your right to feel that you need to know part of the discussion. If there was something in a personnel record that then needed to be made public, or there was no reason that there wasn't going to be any kind of embarrassment to the individual, if there were going to be criminal charges, anything like that, that would certainly become public. But at this point in time, it is not public. It is not open for discussion. In answer to your question, if, if I was on the public dime, then I would think it would be appropriate. It's if never it's appropriate. It is never appropriate. Is Every it a, individual has a right to privacy. Is it appropriate to take people's money and use it to pay them when they don't want to? Is it, is it appropriate for you, regardless of where you work, do you want your personal record at your job performance to be public knowledge? If I'm on the public dime, it had better be. No. Nope. Everybody. I'm talking about everybody. Public, public sector, private sector, it doesn't matter. This is an individual, inalienable right under the Constitution to privacy. And that's what we're talking about. This is a personnel issue, and there is a right to privacy for that individual. Right, I appreci appreciate your transparency. What's your name? Jennifer. What's your last name? <laughs> okay, thanks. I'm the only Jennifer on the council. All right. Nope, can't do that. Federal agents on the streets of Keene, New Hampshire. They're investigating reports of an unlicensed radio station said to be broadcasting LRN.FM. So why all the fuss? What is LRN.FM? Well, it's probably not something these agents want you to listen to. It's a 24-hour news talk broadcast, all pro-liberty. A true authoritarian free zone. Tune in at LRN.FM to listen or broadcast their signal. LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them.